This video will show you how to extend your Windows 10 end of support to another year. To be exact, until October 13, 2026, you'll be receiving security updates and your PC will stay protected. That will give you plenty of time to transition to Windows 11 or think it through. In order to extend your Windows 10 support, you have to enroll for the ESU program or Windows 10 Consumer Extended Security Updates. And to enable ESU in Windows 10, a user must meet these prerequisites, which means certain requirements should be met from your end, for you to even see the option for ESU enrollment. And those are the following. Your device need to be running Windows 10 version 22H2, Home Professional Pro Education or Workstations Edition. Your device need to have the latest Windows updates installed. And finally, your Microsoft account used to sign into the device must be an administrator account. So the first step would be to check or fulfill these prerequisites one by one. Then only we will get to see the option for enrollment. Once you're eligible for the ESU enrollment, you will see the option in your Windows updates. So let's get started. Hope you are using a Microsoft account, if not, sign in with one. And I hope the particular account you're using is the administrator one. Now let's go and make sure that all the latest Windows 10 updates are installed. For that, go to your Start menu and click on Settings. From Settings window, go to Update and Security. And as you can see, I have quite a few updates pending. Also, there is no ESU enrollment option yet. If you have pending updates like me, this is the time to get it updated. I know it's quite time consuming, but we have no other go. So let's wait for a bit. As you can see, all the updates are downloaded and partially installed. Now we have to restart the device to complete the updation. So hit restart, allow it to complete the update. And once it's restarted, we are almost ready to start the ESU enrollment. That is if you have met all the other prerequisites as well. Now let's go to Windows updates again, the same way we previously did. Start menu, settings gear icon, Windows updates. And there it is, enroll in extended security updates. If you don't see this option right away, don't worry, come back in an hour and it will be there. Before we start the actual process, let's talk about the ways you can do it. You can enroll ESU for absolutely free of cost if you sync to your PC settings with OneDrive. Now the second way is to use the Microsoft Reward Points. If you have more than a thousand points in your possession, you would be able to pay for the ESU enrollment by just redeeming a thousand points. This is another free way to enroll ESU if you have Microsoft Reward Points. If you don't know what is a Microsoft Reward Point, it is basically a point system by Microsoft which you can earn by Bing search, shopping from Microsoft and playing games on Xbox. Now coming to the third option to get the Windows 10 ESU enrolled is by paying Microsoft $30 or equivalent in your local currency. For me, I'm opting the first option which is syncing my PC settings with OneDrive, which I already did. You can do so as well by just installing OneDrive, enable PC folder backup for folders like documents, desktop and picture through the OneDrive settings menu. It's pretty straightforward. If you're willing to do one of the above, follow me and let's begin the ESU enrollment. Click the Enroll Now hyperlink, which will open this new window. From here, hit Next and you're at the final step. For me, it says you're eligible to enroll in extended security updates at no extra cost. That is just one of the three options that we previously discussed. Some of you are also seeing the same message or the single option. For us, it's just a matter of clicking this enroll button. It's because we choose the first option and have already synced the PC settings. If you are seeing a different message, like we discussed already, choose the best possible option. So let's hit the enroll button and there you go, you have just extended your Windows 10 end of support to another year. You'll receive security update through October 13, 2026. Thanks for watching, leave a like, subscribe and share. This is your host Amal Rafiq, see you soon with another one.